Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori. It's Sunday and I am headed with Sarah to see Clue for the Broadway series. It's our monthly ticket we have. Coffee and I've caught a cold of some sort or it's allergies, who knows. I'm wearing my dress that I got on Amazon. I've got two hauls I'm going to record for you this morning. Let's fix that. There we go. And, um, yeah, we'll see what we get into. First haul is from Sephora. Um, I do have a Sephora Rewards membership. It's free. You just sign up for it. But if you reach a certain level uh, twice a year, I think, they do a semi-annual sale where they mark down um, <clears throat> everything, <coughs> excuse me, by discounts. Girl, words today are hard. So if you buy Sephora collection stuff, it's all 30% off during this period of time. And then if they have three levels, I think it's like your introduction, your VIP, and your Rouge member, something like that. I'm a middle, so I get... 15% off between a certain date range. That All that to say I get a discount. It's going to be that kind of day. So I wanted to show you what I bought. Because. Okay, so I grabbed, I like this hair brand. It's called Way, O-U-A-I. This is pomade. Um, so when I do my curls up in the front to keep it ruly, I put a little pomade in it. And I wanted to try theirs. Smells really good too. It's a cl like a clay. This is a matte finish, so it won't look wet. Um, but yeah, when your hair's when my hair's dry, I would just put some rubbing on, and you just kind of smoosh it in, and it holds my curls and keeps kind of the flyaways like that under control. So I tried this this product. I love it. I like their leave-in conditioner, their shampoo. Um, they have a spray conditioner. They have a lot of hair product, and I love this. And then I wanted to try, that was my try. Let me turn that off. I'm back, um, doing laundry. Hmm. So I've been wearing, I have to wear sunblock every single day. Uh, we've been through this where I get like sun damage on my skin and they're precancerous. So we try to avoid that. So I wear sunblock every day and then I, so I started buying tinted sunblock and found that now I look kind of washed out. So I wanted to try a liquid blush. Um, this is Rare Beauty and it's a liquid. This color I think is Hope. So I got a sample size, it was like $14. Yeah, Hope. But look at that color. I don't need anything overly pink, but yeah, you just dot it a little bit goes a long way and then you I would then blend it into my sunblock that I have that's tinted um it's mineral sunblock and as opposed to I don't know I, I you hear different things I hear minerals better than chemical chemicals better than mineral here's the deal I just got to put something on my skin and you'll see what I got to help with that and on that note, I picked up a different brand to try. This is Summer Fridays is the brand. I've heard really good things about it. This is Shade Drops Broad Spectrum 30 Mineral Milk Sunscreen. What I'm liking about makeup, <clears throat> makeup version of sunscreen over sports version or sunblock version is that these tend to have some moisturizers in them, like hyaluronic acid or something, depending on the brand is what their active ingredient is. But this one, the, it's, it's zinc is the base, but it also has some moisturizing properties to it, which I need because my skin is dry. So you're supposed to shake it. And listen, it's very sheer, which I like. And then you squeeze it out. It doesn't smell bad. The Super Goop one I have smells weird. This one does not. And it does have a little tint to it. So I grabbed this, um, the SPF 30, for my face. Which, whether I'm going out in the sun or not, we're wearing it. So this is uh, Summer Fridays, is the brand. 
Now, this is my moisturizer. This is my daily stuff that I wear under my sunblock. And the brand is called The Ordinary. I love this brand. It is so reasonably priced for a fantastic product. It's made in Canada. It is cruelty-free. And it does not have a bunch of junk in it. It is basically just what it says it is. So I grabbed two. These are both moisturizers. So what I do in the morning after I wash my face is I put a serum on. I have one that has hyaluronic acid and retinol in it. And then I follow it with a moisturizer and let it sit for a minute. And then I put on my sunblock. So this one here specifically is natural moisturizing factors, phytoceramides, rich surface hydration. I'm very dry. This is for every day. This is 3.4 ounce. Oh. 3.4 ounces and um, it lasts. You do not need a lot of these products, which is fantastic. And I don't remember if this was $20 or something. Uh, so I have this one that I use every day, but I wanted a travel size. That doesn't come in a travel size. So I just picked up the, this is just a regular moisturizer by The Ordinary. And this is just a one ounce. So this will go in my travel bag. I've got two pretty big trips, well, I have one big trip coming up and I have one small trip next week. I'm headed to Canada for a three-day weekend and um, I'm bringing some travel stuff to try it out before I head to Ireland this summer, but I wanted this to just throw in my bag. I could decant these things, but I just felt like this was small enough that it's not going to make any difference if I squeeze this into another container. So I grabbed that for the road and I needed a replacement for the home. Speaking of travel, if you order online, you can get some samples. So I got this Necessaire body cream to try. Um, I'm just going to throw it in my travel bag. And this is my moisturizer for my, throw it on my body one day while I'm getting ready. And then these little perfumes, this is Gucci Flora. So not only can you try it, it's the perfect travel size. That will last me a week. That's a week's worth of perfume for me. I don't, oh, I don't put a lot on. So that's definitely a week's worth of perfume. Let's do our thumbnail. So yeah, um, you get to pick what you want too. So I always get the ones that have the spray bottle and I haven't put perfume on today. Just a little squirt. I love this. I may be buying this in the full size bottle. I have a lot of perfume right now, so I'm trying to go use it all before I buy more, but this is definitely on my radar and it's by Gucci. I don't know the price point, I'm sorry. Um, those were just some samples. And then the big thing other that I purchased was this kit. Maybe this would be my thumbnail. This kit from Sephora, it is the Sun Safety Kit. Also, each purchase supports the Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center, which is nice. It's $178 value retail. I paid $40 and then I got my 14% off. And then on the back, it, if you take it apart, it goes through each product, but I'm just gonna show you. So you get this fun little, it's like corduroy makeup bag. Um, taking out the cardboard from it so it's a it's a actually the bag is not bad it's lined so it'll hold all my sun protection I suppose but here's what I don't it's not very structured which could be good for a travel bag it doesn't matter I didn't buy it for the bag here's what's in it so you get and this is on sale this is still there I just I don't know if it's on sale still but you get two, potentially three full-size products. I'm not sure if this is considered a full-size. But what these are, are all these different brands, facial sunblocks that have different properties to them. So I can try them out and find one that I land on that I like. Without spending, the one I got from Summer Fridays, that was $40. So if I don't love this, I'm still going to use it. But here I get to try all different things. This is Fenty Skin Hydrate Visor Broad Spectrum Mineral Sunscreen SPF 30, and it's a moisturizer. So I got a full bottle of that. This is an ounce. 
I don't want to put it on because I already put my foundation on. I mean, my sunblock. It doesn't smell weird. Um, It's pink. Let's hope that blends in. I'm sure it will. So these are all just different sunblocks. So we got the Fenty brand. And then I got a full bottle of Polyglumat Poly Glu Glumasic Acid Dewy Sunscreen by the Inky List. And this is um, SPF 30. 30 seems to be the standard. I'm gonna open it because we wanna sniff it. I really want something that smells summery. That's kind of the, doesn't smell bad. The thing, I love a coconut sunblock. I know it's a, it's terrible, but it's true. So this is 1.7 fluid ounce. Any of these can go in a carry-on bag as well, which is nice. And then this is the St. Jane Luxury Sun Ritual Pore Smoothing SPF 30. Again, and this is in a small tube, which can be taken in your carry-on. So you get that sunblock. And all of this is like facial care. Here is one. This is by Kiehl's Better Screen UV Serum Sunscreen Bod Spectrum 50 Plus. The Kiehl's one to try. I don't... Kiehl's is not certified um, cruelty free. So I try not to buy too many of these products. Sometimes I have to. Same with Dr. Jart. I love this Sycophore cream, Sycopair. Sycopair is what it's called. I'm gonna, I learned this yesterday that it's kind of runny in here. This is not a sunscreen. It is tiger grass correcting treatment. So if you have any discoloration, I get redness. Like if you have rosacea, any type of reddening on your skin, this stuff is the bomb. It's green. You literally just put a little dot and you blend it in. You don't even have to cover it with like foundation and it neutralizes that red on your face. It is a little expensive, but literally a drop of it I put one little dot under each eye when my bags are really purple and I just blend it out and it gets rid of that discoloration. And I'm super excited to have this little tiny bottle of it that I can take with me and then I can refill it from my bigger bottle. My bigger one's a little thicker than this, but, and this is Derma Green Solution. So this is not a sunblock, but it is a face product. This is Polish Choice Youth Extending Daily Hydrating Fluid with an SPF of 50 in it to try. Again, half an ounce, but honestly, this would last a couple weeks. I'm looking for some smelly good stuff. Um, so there's that. I actually, this is a small tube of the Summer Fridays that I just pulled out. Um, this is Shade Drops. It's the same as that. It's just the sample size. I don't know that I, this is a 1.6 fluid ounce. That would probably be a couple days worth. That's definitely not um, like a week supply. If it was a bigger tube, just depends, but this is probably a couple days worth for me. Uh, this is Dr. Dennis Gross Ultimate Defense SPF 50 Cream. I mean, honestly, I'm so excited to try all, oopsies. Okay, well, this one is a little thin, which I don't mind for my face. And this one feels really nice. And what, that's what I like about it. It's not sticky, it's not thick. It doesn't smell, it doesn't smell like summer. That's okay, I know something in here does. I've already tried it. Uh, this is Innis Free Daily UV Defense Sunscreen Broad Spectrum 36 brand this is their brand or their take like there's so much in here this is shiseido urban environment vita clear invisible protection vitamin c broad spectrum spf 42 i don't know how they determine what spectrum it is i don't this is a weird little container though i'm not sure about this this is really hard and you gotta somehow like squeeze it out Look at me, I'm giving you my play-by-play -play on their packaging. But that's stuff I have to think about. These are suntan drops. 
And I don't know what you do with these. I have to kind of research. It's a medium self tanning drops. Get set glow one to 12 drops to a minimum of two milliliters of your okay so you add these to your favorite moisturizer so you put a dollop of moisturizer you put some drops in here you rub it on your face and it's supposed to help self tan you yeah i don't know about that we'll try it but we'll see but that's island paradise these are self tanning drops this is from peter thomas roth water drench broad spectrum 45 hyaluronic cloud which is interesting so if i don't want color and look at that little packaging this one would this one is an spf but doesn't have any tint to it so it would just be my normal skin which is actually fine um and it has a lot of moisturizing properties to it which is exciting so i'm going to try that out for me it has to have moisturizer in it because i'm very dry and if i don't have a moisturizer I, my skin is gross this is super goop unseen now i have the super goop tinted that they just came out with and it's, it's okay i'm using it today uh this is the unseen broad spectrum sunscreen sps 40 water and sweat resistance so this is more of a traditional and it says it's good for 40 minutes so this is your traditional take it to the beach you're swimming you're ex exercising you're outside you're sweating you're getting wet this is their sunscreen for that. So this is a little different, I think. In my mind, it's a little different than like a makeup sunscreen that I would put on in the morning and it would last through the day. This is something, uh, it doesn't smell, that you would reapply. You know, if you're outside and you're, you need a facial moisture, a facial summer, take it to the pool stuff, which I have some of these, not this brand. But this is definitely formulated for your face specifically. So that's good to have because I always need that. And then the last thing that came in here, and I've already tried this, it is Sun Care K Skin Isle Lip Balm. This is a lip. So it's a lippy. It's clear. I used some last night. It smells like the beach. Oops. It's um it's very thick. That is one thing. Hi, Alec. But it's nice. It has a coconutty feel to it. I could smell, taste. And it, obviously, it's a 30 SPS for your lips. Let's not forget that we have to put sunblock. And you want to reapply that often if you're out in the sun on the lips. Alex, what are you doing, buddy? Why don't you lay down? Um, and I like this a lot. Mm, it's got a nice thickness to it. It would stay on when you're outside doing whatever it is that we do. And that is everything that came from Sephora today. I'm super excited to try out a bunch of these products. Um, you know, I don't know. They don't do free samples like they used to anymore. A lot of the stores, you know, they used, you buy stuff. And I will say I spent on all of this in total, I spent $150. $135 on all of these products and you get one free sample which I think is weird I love samples because I like to try different products but that's okay everything fits in its nice little bag it'll go upstairs and everything will go into rotation so what I will do is um, each time I need to put some each morning I will pick a product Put my sunscreen on over my makeup wear it for the day and use it up and then when i find out exactly which one i love then i can go buy a full size which is what i enjoy about that all right i hope that was helpful for you and gave you some ideas summer's coming but we all need to wear our sunscreen because we don't want cancer there's alex all right everybody have a fantastic day and i'm getting ready to film a dollar tree haul